and even more so relinquished the lead four times in that 4-4 draw. But the two biggest cities in Saudi Arabia, represented tonight by their finest, the Saudi Derby feels as electric as ever. Whether you are in Riyadh, in Jeddah, or somewhere a little further afield tonight, this is 90 minutes of football you do not want to miss. One strides out as champion, the other with sight of their crown. And we have sensed for a while that Al Ittihad will be relinquishing their league title in the months ahead. But uh, is this the evening where Al Hilal show that they are the ones who are ready to take it from them? This is the Saudi Derby, always one of those fixtures that football fans in this country immediately... ...who is a tricky customer. His first delivery of the night is away by Fabinho and then hit by Neves. And you heard that little roar that went up in the stadium as Neves was taking aim there because... ...there's Malcolm. Showing that low centre of gravity that he possesses. Just about enough on the pass from... Michel to get it to Abdul Hamid and he's got the corner the first one of the evening see of late but this is where football will be for a while for this team a team that have won another corner here from that firm cross from Lodi well I mentioned about Aliti I'd change it to a he can start things for Al Halal Koulibaly's trying to get something going here though and the goalkeepers done well twofold there to... and it goes from Al Gamdi and in it comes dangerously, it's a brilliant header from Conte. Well, they've soaked up 11 and a half minutes of Al Hilal pressure. And now they lead at the league leaders. And N'Golo Conte has fired that in with his head. A scoreline that few were expecting in the derby. But always expect something in this derby. Al Hilal nil. Al Isi have won. Amazing header. Absolutely amazing header from N'Golo Conte. But well, you have to say it's all about the delivery. Sorry, down that left-hand side, whipped a fantastic ball in. And Golo Kante, when they did work at wide, just got off his run out. It's about to cross. The delivery is on the money. And when you're a midfield player, break into the 18-yard box. You can see the ball. Al Shahiri's trying to get forward into the middle. What's the referee given? Where was the contact? It is a free kick just outside the penalty area. Must have been very good. Hit the target here. Neves has not done that. Halsari, Hamdala, Romarinho awaiting. It didn't quite get to him. The slide in Al Belahi, but the flag was up anyway. Mishail trying to trick his way to make the room. Say the goal scorer. Oh, well, Sahafi with the trick. And then struck from distance. Unlucky Al Gamdi. Bono got a touch on that. What a strike. Lovely skill from Romarinho with a nutmeg. That's how confident this side are. Well, Gamdi hit this. Normally you go not. That should be the two fullbacks. Help to create. Mishail, neat touch. Milinkovic, sad. brilliant career in this league. That's a great pass. Al Dorsari just out of the reach of Malcolm. Good defending again. This time Kadesh. Well, they know who could he? Went for a really precise pass to Romarinho. It's a foul that N'Golo Conte is not going to get away with. Milinkovic Savic is absolutely convinced that Conte should be booked for them. There's Milinkovic Savic. It's seen out of play by Luis Philippe. Not like him, but he's loose from the pass there. Milinkovic Savic. Bit heavy. Who are still trailing from that Conte goal. He might get it back here if Al Shahiri gets Al Sahafi. Still got it. Might drop for Hampton. It's a poor tackle from Fabinho and no surprise to see the referee delving into his pop holes in the al had defence, frankly, because there aren't many. No, exactly that, because they aren't compact. Five across the back for al -Itihad. Absolutely full of goals this season. Now, Halal, oh, the goalkeeper came. Koulibaly leapt with him. And it's the defender who's been penalised. Hussein, was it me? The referee says, yep. So he's the one on the corner. Goalkeeper and defender in a bit of a mess. Neves hit it pretty well. It was hit even better, though, for 1-1. That is a belter of a strike. And for the first time tonight, an error. 
in that Al Itihad defence. Eyes on goalkeeper Al Mayouf. And capitalised upon by Salah Al Shahiri. And it's 1 1. Yeah, lovely strike. They needed a bit of fortune, I think. I think they were drifting in the. Hagazi has stayed in there. No, is between. Oh, oh, there's a push on Hagazi. The referee's given a penalty. But there didn't seem to be too many Al Itihad complaints. Me neither. Be very interesting, well, isn't it? That's the problem for Kula Bali. Right, I mean. If I was the referee, I'd stick with your on-field decision. Looked a good one to me. He's cancelled the penalty. Well, Shahiri shifting it infield, and the flag is up for offside. Or the ball will actually have gone behind anyway. But I think there were one or two out. Leads, and waiting in the middle was Al Dorsari, and he couldn't convert. What an effort. That's how Al Halal play. That was better. Al Shahiri tipped away by Al Mayouf. Really good stop. His position was a good one. He shouldn't be beating it. He's near post. And at half time in the Saudi derby, it's Al Halal 1. Al Introduction of Ahmed Al Gamdi, who's on for Faisal Al Gamdi in midfield, which is uh, an interesting change, Don, because we were saying about how well Al Gamdi played in the first half. So I just wonder whether forward is provided by Al Sahafi, and Bono takes it before. And uh, he felt that it would broaden his mind coming to Saudi Arabia. Yellow card season. That's good from Hamdala, and that is an almost certain booking for Al Shahiri for the tug. I mean, the referee couldn't be. And still, he goes on the fullback, and he's won the free kick as well Lovely on the stuff. periphery of the Al Halal penalty area. Yeah, yeah. Don Ruben Nevin. The answer is no, not with that strike. Really, not even close to adding to his to uh, change the narrative. The last scored one from 35 years, uh, 35 <laughs> yards. The claim is one of four. One who leapt was Milinkovic Savic. Difficult one. Yeah, it's been unlike him tonight. How quiet he's been. Over Al Shahiri, but not beyond the attempts of Malcolm, who, at the same end that Angolo Conte scored in the first half, has just delivered a remarkably similar goal. A diving header, a tenth in the league this season for the Brazilian. And for the first time tonight, a lead for Al Halal. Yeah, interesting if the referee goes to the monitor or takes instruction, because there was a potential penalty claim from Alitiad. Let's just see here as the ball gets delivered in the box. Does it strike a hand? No. So then they go up the other end of the pitch. Great work this time. I mentioned Milinkovic Savic. This is where he wants to be. Delivers. And here's Conte, and he's missed the chance for 2 2. What a chance. I thought Hamdala, at one point when Conte put him through, should have. Deep. Clever that. Fabinho. Well, watch Bono. Really good move. Fabinho will be kicking himself there. This is nicely works, and this is Abdul Hamid for Al Hilal. Good muscle, great body work, super finish. And that's the right back who's just done that. Magnificent individual goal from Saud Abdul Hamid. The game will never change. Doesn't matter what league. Kawa. <laughs> 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 <laughs>